makes them good. Hey YouTube, so as some of you may know, I went to see Dane Cook this past weekend in Atlantic City. So my friend Lena and I made a day out of it after we worked together. At 3 o'clock we headed down to Atlantic City and we stopped at Lush. So I have a Lush haul for you guys today. It's really small because, you know, I already have a lot of Lush stuff. And then we went to dinner, and then we saw Dane eighth row. It was really funny. Um, Lena got to meet his opening act, Al Del Bene. I met him last year when I saw him. He was really funny. So, our mission is to eventually meet Dane Cook, though. So, we'll see if that happens. So, let's get started with the haul. Oh, let's see. So, first I got... Strawberry Feels Forever. And it smells just like yummy yummy. It's a massage bar. I can't wait to use it. And my Lush was running out of like these little bags, so they had to put like more than one in like each bag. So we'll see. But yes, that's Strawberry Feels Forever. Then I got Space Girl Bath Bomb. It's all pink and glittery and it looks like Saturn and it smells really good kind of citrusy and lemony I don't know and like sweet at the same time I don't know how to describe it but it's really good and I like how it has glitter on it although it's probably going to be a pain to clean out of the tub but after I try that one out because I already have one that I got online from the um, North American website but it really didn't have glitter on it so that's why I wanted to get one in the store that had glitter on it and then I got stepping stone and it's for your feet and it's really citrusy smelling um the girl at the store just said you rub it on your feet now i'm not sure do you use it when your feet are wet do you wet it do you make it into a paste um if anyone knows please comment below and let me know because i'm totally clueless clueless on how to use this one and it's, i can't find anyone who knows how to use it so please let me know and then i got some emoto bomb. I got the too drunk one for when it's supposed to help for when you're hungover. It smells like really musky. And then I got sex in the shower emoto bomb, which reminds me of the sex bomb. It smells so good. I can't wait to use that one but it's like falling apart really easily. I have to put this stuff into baggies later on. The smells are combining from having more than one in one bag. Next, I got, oh wait, I found this in my bag. My Dane Cook ticket. There's my Dane Cook ticket. We are in section 101, row H. So, that's my Dane Cook ticket. So, as you can tell, I really love Dane Cook. Like, that was, like, my sixth time seeing him. Loved him in Good Luck Chuck. Um, you know, Employee of the Month. And My Best Friend's Girl is a really good movie. I like that one a lot. And then I just got two soaps. But first, I'll show you the sample. Um, they gave me a sample of Sympathy for the Skin Body Cream, but I already have, like, a full tub of it. And then they gave me... Ultralight Facial Moisturizer, which has SPF 15 in it. It came in containers like that. And then let's go on to the soaps. For soaps, I got I Should Cocoa, and I got $7.94 worth of it. And I will open it for you guys since I'm going to put this away after the video. I don't want to rip the sticker because I put the sticker on the baggies. Now, this one's being retroed, so I wanted to get some when I was running out. Looks like this. And then the top, you know, has the coconut on it. And it's not as coconutty smelling as whatever I would have expected it to be. Quincomir of the Nineveh definitely has more of a coconut smell. I like that one a lot better. This one does, but it's not as strong, and I love anything that smells like coconut or tastes like coconut. You know, I eat coconut, so... 
of course. And then I got Ice Blue, $6.72 worth. You know, the girl was a little off cutting them, but whatever. Um, I've never had Ice Blue soap before, so that's why I got it. I heard it's good for sunburn. Although I don't burn, but my stepdad wanted to smell it because he apparently wants some Lush soap now. So I'm getting everyone in my family into Lush. No. Um, the piece looks like this. And then, now I don't know, is it supposed to be white like that? Um, if anyone knows, like just, you know, once again, comment below. And I love the smell, it's very minty. And like, apparently there used to be an old color. Cause my friend has one that was like blue and purple. And now it's just like all blue. Cause I was looking at like the hunks of it in the store. Sorry, that was someone in AIM. So that's the light blue. Ah, it smells so minty. So like I said, it was a very small haul. Altogether, it came out to like $50, which isn't bad. Um, so if you have any questions or comments, once again, leave them below. And I hope you have all had a great day, and I'll talk to you later.